All right, guys. Well, today I thought I'd show you my dock. So if we just go down here. All righty. First we have Finder. Um, we all know what Finder does. Uh, next I have a little space. Then I have Mail. Um, you just check my mail. You know, uh, I have a .Mac account. So uh, address book. Uh, whoops. Address book. Um, use it for uh, addresses and such. iWeb. Um, I don't really use it that much. Um, I mean, I do have a website up. I mean, I just threw it together one night and find it that interesting. So I don't really use it. iCal, I don't use that. It's like a calendar thing. Uh, GarageBand, um, you know, I use it to make a few songs. Um, not, not really into it anymore. Uh, iTunes, um, I have this open um, just about all the time. Um, I, I have a lot of songs, um, a lot of ACDC. Um, Next we got uh, Safari. Uh, we all know what that is. It's a, brow a web browser. Uh, another space. Um, then we got Pages. Pages. Um, it's like it's like Word. Um, I use Pages mostly for all of my word processing. Then I have Word, PowerPoint, Excel. I don't really use them that much. I use PowerPoint sometimes, but I don't really use those. Um, then I got Stickies. I uh, you use that to take notes and, and stuff. Um, another space. Uh, we got Google Earth. It's uh, satellite images of the Earth. It's pretty cool if you got nothing to do and you're bored. Um, next, we got Marble Arena. It's um, it's a game. Um, there, there's a little uh, marble. It, it, it's interesting. Um, ping Pop. It's another game. It'll bounce bounce the ball around, destroy the bricks. I guess. Chess. Um, it's a game. Obviously, came with the computer. Uh, Mac Tracker. Uh, lets you uh, lets you look at the details of every Mac back to the beginning. The Macintosh XL. Oh, screw that. Um, right here gives you. It's pretty cool. That was expensive back then. Jesus. Um, next we got Liquid Mac. Um. It's an interesting application. Um, I, I'm not really going to show it to you right now because it'll, it'll be kind of hard. <clears throat> but I might later. Uh, Skype. Skype is uh, you can make calls on your computer over the internet. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Um, Adium. It's like iChat. Um, I find it a little bit easier to use and I, I like the little monster. Um, he's kind of cool. Uh, Spacer. iDVD. I don't really make that many DVDs so uh, not that much. Next. Um, iMovie HD and Final Cut Express. Um, I really don't use, well, I, I use them both, but if I'm just like cutting, you know, just clips together, uh, like this, what I'm doing right now, I'll just use iMovie HD, but if I'm really going to get into the editing, I'll use Final Cut Express. Still learning how to use that. Uh, Photoshop, uh, I use that a lot, make some funny pictures. It's pretty cool. Aperture, I don't really use that. It's, it's, um, it's still on trial, but I, I don't really use it. I don't really have any need for it. Um, iPhoto. I, yeah, I just use iPhoto. Uh, photo booth. Um, I got the the extra effects for it. They're really cool. Uh, QuickTime Player. You know, you know what that is. iSquint. Uh, it lets you convert just about any uh, video file into MP4. It's uh, pretty amazing, especially when I want to <coughs> take videos and like that are in a weird format and put them into my iTunes library just convert them to MP4 tube Tubal um, Tubal is just probably one of the coolest applications I have it lets you download and uh, convert videos from YouTube um, I use it almost every day it's so cool um, system preferences we don't know what that does activity monitor I show you, uh, that's the application I'm using right now to <coughs> record uh, the screen. Um, next we got coconut battery. Um, it's pretty cool. It shows shows the stats of my battery, like, you know, uh, charge, capacity, age. It's pretty cool. Um, Tech Tool Deluxe. Um, just, like, check your system for, like, errors, I, I guess. I came with my... Um, um, Apple Care CD Onyx. It's like a, a utility for uh, OS 10 Leopard. It um, 
it's it's pretty cool. I, I guess. Uh, App Zapper lets you delete applications. Um, and like all their files, which they may have hidden on your computer in places. Um, light icon lets you change the icons for your applications and folders and all kinds of stuff. It's pretty cool. Uh, boot Camp Assistant. I manage my uh, boot camp partitions with that. DVD backup. I use that to um, to rip the file. Whoops. To rip the files off of DVDs and put them right on my computer, so I don't have to carry them around to to watch them. It's pretty useful, actually. Uh, Tinker Tool lets you uh, change certain aspects of your system. Um, like I don't know. It, it's it's all right, I guess. Um, Pip my doc. That's what I used to uh, to get this uh, really cool blackish dark dock. Um, it, it's pretty cool. Uh, terminal. We all know what terminal is. Terminal's pretty cool. I like terminal. Um, and then there's time machine. Time machine's awesome. Um, I like the icon. And well, I have my backup drive connected right now, so I'll just click on it. But it is really cool. I mean. It's so awesome that I can just like go back through like, like since my computer was like born. It's just amazing. Um, and um, where's the doc? I got a little, uh, then documents. I keep all my work for school, uh, downloads, and then trash. And uh, that's just about it. So if uh, any of you guys have any questions you can just uh, message me or leave a comment and I'll uh, I'll try and answer you and uh, yeah that's it